Hi there, this is Eric with Fluid Dynamics and wanted to give you a short video because this is something that comes up quite a lot, came up again today, about the relationship of hard water lime scale, lime scale produced from hard water, and bacteria, in this case specifically Legionella. It's a topic that's on everyone's mind that is managing a facility, especially if it's a sensitive healthcare or hospitality facility. So I wanted to pull up this article from 2013. It's directly from Water Quality Products website. So I'd, I've been using this for a couple of years to explain this to people. And you give some background about the Legionella bacterium, what it's officially called, where it got its name. But I highlighted some important things here. Normally linked to cooling towers, evaporative condensers, mist machines, humidifiers, whirlpool spas, and showers. And then you can see, again, jump down to the highlight, hangs out in areas like tanks, reservoirs, dead legs, and piping systems with poor flow areas. That's why a lot of times they'll get a hit in a sink that's not used that frequently because there's not enough water coming through there that's actually been disinfected. Give some information about temperatures here. Just scrolling down, wanted to show you the the actual picture of the bacteria or of the scale and what we're looking at here is bacteria produces a hotbed uh, or the scale produces a hotbed for bacterial growth and that's why if you eliminate remove or reduce the amount of scale that's in the system you're going to be able to reduce the risk of Legionella. So I promise I'm not going to read you this whole article there'll be links to it in the page that you're on right now as well as on below the video I'll I'll go ahead and post a link there. There's some background about what scale is and where it can deposit, why this is important in all parts of your plumbing system is because you can see here, dripping taps can even deposit scale. So that's another key thing there. It's not just gonna be in those areas. Anywhere in the plumbing system that water's running over is a potential for scale. Now it's more common on areas where heat exchange takes place. So we're talking about hot water systems where there's heat transfer and you're looking for that water to be heated up. Well, that's also going to be a place that scale actually is more likely to be present. So here's the key. If you reduce the scale, you can reduce the potential for risk of Legionella. That's quite simply it. So here's some more information you'll be able to look through here. Now here's where we come in at the end of the article, we have a solution for this. So the nice thing is that our units from a benefit perspective, once you go in line, like you see one cut into a, a system here on top of a pump, you don't have any electric, there's no extra footprint, no water to use, extra water. Expected life is about 15 plus years in a commercial environment. And it's not a new technology. So over 42, 43 years now plus in the field in 40 countries with a million installations. So we can help you reduce or remove the scale in your system and therefore reduce and remove, never say 100% remove, but greatly reduce the risk that you're going to have of Legionella in those lines. So here's just some specifications. The other nice thing that I will say about our lines is that there's no limit as to the size, we size based on flow. So I opened up specifications just to share with you here. Here's some model numbers and you can see sizes and weights. The max pressure of 232 PSI, we go pretty high here. And the, these specs are gonna show you up to two inch, but we have large units that we can actually go to any size. So off the shelf, our larger product, the colloidal transcope, 12 inches, but there's no limitation. The important thing here is that we size based on flow and bigger is not better. So we just ask you some questions. There'll be some links here again if you wanna get more information or submit some information to, to uh, go over a project. We're happy to have a free consultative call with you. And again, reducing the risk of Legionella, a Legionnaire's disease by reducing the amount of scale in the system. This is Eric with Fluid Dynamics. We make water better for you and for your business.